It was a harrowing rescue early this morning, just north of Spokane. Spokane County deputies forced their way into a burning home early this morning to save a suicidal man suspected of sexually molesting a young family member. It happened near Riverside in North Spokane County, and KXY4 Sally Showman is live tonight. Sally. Dave, early this morning, 911 got a phone call from a 15 year old boy. He told dispatchers his father had raped a child inside their trailer. After a dramatic encounter with sheriff's deputies, the suspect was taken into custody, and tonight he's at the Spokane County Jail. A quiet trailer today, the only sign of the mayhem that transpired here last night are boarded up windows. But deputies say this is a crime scene on many levels. It's devastating. You don't hear that kind of stuff. 40 year old David Jewell reportedly sexually assaulted a child here last night. When his 15 year old son called 911, the nightmare got worse. It's basically all of our north side cars were headed up to this North Newport Highway address. After letting three children out the front door of the trailer, Jewell reportedly made a flamethrower out of an aerosol can and a lighter. He set the curtains on fire in the kitchen, the cabinets. Uh, he set on fire. He went to the living room. He set blinds and drapes on fire in the living room. And he was holding that can with the flame out the, and pointing it at the, at the deputies. In an attempt to rescue Jewel and any other potential victims, deputies kicked down a door, at which point they say Jewel threatened them with fire and a knife. Deputies used a taser and a nightstick to knock him to the ground. Three deputies pulled Jewel out of the burning trailer as a third worked to put out the flames. It doesn't matter what the person's accused of. Um, their, their first and foremost concern is to get him out of there, save his life. It just makes me sick. Honestly makes me sick. Neighbor Maria Payne is heart sick today after hearing what the sheriff's office says happened to a little girl next door. I just feel so bad. That little girl's going to be messed up for a long time. After rescuing Jewel, de deputies discovered that he had taken a large amount of painkillers, so he was transported to a local hospital before being booked here at the Spokane County Jail. Tonight, he's charged with first degree child molestation and first degree arson. Live at the Spokane County Jail, Sally Shellman, KXOI 4 HD News.